Hi, my name is Defon Smith. I go by Orb. I'm a freestyle expressionist of dance. I describe myself as humble, very hardworking at what I want to accomplish, and positive energy. <laughs> yeah. Freestyle expression dance to me is freedom, freedom in movement. You have two arms, two legs, and it depends on what you do with it, is, is your choice of expressing your own self. How I started dancing, um, basically uh, I used to watch my sisters get loose in the, the living room. They used to watch the Soul Train. That was one of the uh, things that got me interested in just rhythm and movement. Back in the 80s, there was a lot of break dancing going on in my neighborhood. So that also got me interested in the, the physical part of like, you know, flips and acrobatic movements and stuff like that. As I got older, there's a lot of people that I look up to, other dancers that I saw on the scene, especially in hip hop. Hip hop is a big influence to my youth. So watching videos and seeing all these uh, other dancers um, representing these videos, of course, I would try to imitate those movements. And I just pretty much, you know, took it from there. My group is Circle of Fire, and we've been around here in Seattle for a little bit over 10 years. Circle of Fire is soul. It's basically the soul of a dancer. We change up to any rhythm, um, adapt to any environment. We pretty much do it all. Monday nights at the War Room consist of dancers coming together, friends coming together with a common art you know, form to, to basically create at that moment. And nobody's really performing, everybody's just expressing themselves. When I first step into the circle on Monday night, I don't really think uh, too much about the movement in itself. It's more of I'm just listening to the rhythm of the, the music that's being played. It's kind of like having a blank canvas and a paintbrush, and you don't even know what you're going to put onto that canvas. You're just going to freestyle it. If it was a good crowd, you're going to probably end up doing some incredible stuff because you're, you're feeling them, you're feeling the music, so that just enhances your creativity level to go even higher. And I've seen things get pulled off by dancers that are just unbelievable because the crowd kept egging them on to you know, keep it hype. The attitude uh, t towards women in the hip hop world here in Seattle is positive, it's definitely positive. Women are, are flourishing in the scene of, of breaking, house dancing, freestyle, hip hop, and all kinds of styles. Yeah, I have a strong spiritual background because I grew up in a, a Baptist church. So I used to see uh, grandmothers, moms, fathers, grandfathers catch the Holy Ghost in church. It's like, you know, that's when the choir is going and the music's hype and, and you know, the grandmother or your mom gets up and she's crying and she's just feeling the music and, you know, catching the vibe. So I take that with me when I'm dance floor dancing. You can almost catch me like closing my eyes and really getting into that, that ghost or, you know, that music and that spiritual, you know, form or the essence of that, that rhythm. What I do for a living, I work at Pro Aerobics Conditioning uh, Club up on Queen Anne. I basically uh, do contract sales. One of the perks of working there at the club, what I like is uh, working out inside of the aerobic studio, which I practice up to two to three times a week. Fredo is my buddy of mine. He's in my crew. He goes by the name of Free.
free, sometimes practice together. It's a great way for us to critique each other's uh, style and moves and for us to grow off of each other. It takes a lot of practice. Um, I mean, I, I practice hard. Like, I practice pretty much. I, I think I dance every day, put it that way. But it's, it's nothing grueling in the sense of uh, wasted energy or anything like that. For me, it's meditative. Oh, I like using the, um, the towel while I dance because it's. Uh, it just shows that it's freestyle, it's not planned. Um, so with that, it's, you know, it's wherever that thing can go, it lands and you just gotta try to catch it and, and dance while you're doing it. It just makes me open up to a new movement. Hip hop definitely changed my personality in a sense. I mean, it wasn't like I was a mean person before I got into this art form, but it's definitely a stress reliever. And it helps out too with a lot of people that are in bad situations get out of you know get out of it into good situations. Yeah, I think hip hop is definitely a, a good outlet for anybody, youth, old, young, whoever. So. That's the danger. That's the danger that you face when you dance in the streets. Oh, I, I have so much to learn. <laughs> and that's the joy of life. If, if I don't have anything to learn, then I might as well not be here on this planet. But that's, that's what keeps me alive and that's what keeps me, you know, loving life is the, the learning process of it. Because that's, you know, you reach your goal and then it's what's next. So, yeah. <laughs>